You get it? Once you've figured it out, then you can actually do it. But if you, you can't actually do it at the beginning until you've figured it out. You need to figure out how to build your instrument before it can be played. And most young actors, like myself, I'm using that in the past tense, when I was a young actor, <clears throat> uh, graduated from theater school, and I was, what do you want? You want a tuba? You want a piccolo? I'm a fucking double violin. Check this out! I can be a kazoo. Like, I could be anything. I could play anything. And I totally misunderstood. It's, I am this slightly dented, very confused soprano saxophone. <laughs> With, with broken notes and a kind of very funny timber, and my E note is hilarious. And that's who I am. And now, play anything you want through me. And so you got to get through that process. You see? And when you're... That is the key to what people call confidence. Because if you ask, we, have, we bring up a lot of casting directors. These LA casting directors, directors, uh, uh, when I ask them, so what's the major quality that you need from an actor in the room? What's the, what's the one winning kind of thing, an actor, when they walk into the room, what does an actor need? They all say, confidence. Which, of course, scares the shit out of me. <laughs> and you should all be pissing yourselves now, because that sucks. Because who in the room is confident? None of you. None of you are. I'm not. I never met anybody who's confident. Confidence is a lie. It doesn't exist. Insecurity is the norm. You are all incredibly insecure. You're all intensely vulnerable, really insecure, and self-hating, and kind of confused. So, confidence. I like myself. I know. I'm great. Look at me. I'm good. It doesn't exist. And people try to plaster it on, put it on, put on the confident face, and then they fail. And we go, ugh. And that that's becomes, it slips into arrogance. Whereas true confidence, real confidence, is going, geez, I'm an insecure, fucked up mess, and my ego is weird, and I'm, uh, I'm a boy who can't grow up, and I'm a child of a schizophrenic, and this is who I am. Oh, I'm okay with that. And then come in and then do your job. And that's what real confidence is. You need to be, you need to be somebody who's incredibly self-aware. Self-aware is not self-love. Self-aware is self-aware. You know that you can be petty and stupid, and you know that you can be... Uh, ego driven and you know you'd be a jerk and you know that you've hurt people and you know you know that you can be kind of silly and you know you're a goof and you know that you're a child sometimes and you know and you know you and then you walk into the room and you know who you are and then you do the job and the job's really easy but then we go oh that was so interesting we like that we like that instrument what we need at this point in the symphonies for piccolo let's let's hire that piccolo and that's what happens about